In this episode, I'm going to look at another unit test principle, the agnostic behaviors principle. Tests should be entirely agnostic to the implementation and should only test behaviors. All tests should not be tied to any one implementation, i.e. tests should define behaviours and make no assumptions about any implementation details, no matter how obvious or embedded those may seem. For instance, if your code will absolutely always and never will change from using things like SQL, you still shouldn't include implementation detail in any tests. You should be able to run those tests, those tests that assert behavior against any implementation, should that be with SQL Server, with files on disk, with Oracle, with a document database such as MongoDB. That should make no difference to the tests passing and asserting the required behavior. So by making your test agnostic to the implementation and only, only depending on behaviors means you're adhering to this principle. And hopefully that result in tests that don't break every time you make an implementation detail change. If you find this principle interesting, then why not check out my other two testing principles, the passive coverage principle and the test protraction principle, both of which hope to provide some guidance in how tests should be written and to avoid some of the pitfalls that are commonly occurring in code today. And don't forget to click on like, click on subscribe. And if you want to get notifications when I post videos, Click on the bell.